Officials are warning that Hawaii is only now entering a dangerous wildfire season. Forecasters say the next couple of months are the most prevalent for potentially threatening conditions. Stephen Florino has more. Wildfires on all islands have been all over the news lately. But the worst may be yet to come. But we're seeing conditions drift into those sort of high fire risk uh, conditions that we're well aware of, especially we've had lots of um, windy trade wind days. So when we get trade winds, those drying fuels, and then all it takes is uh, an ignition. According to forecasters from the National Weather Service, conditions will be most prevalent for fire weather watch or red flag warning conditions in August and September. That means warm temperatures, very low humidity, and strong winds can combine to produce an increased risk of fire danger. Expect for the extra chance of fire. Um, if, those, if fire does break out, it might be harder to contain for firefighters. Forecasters say the issue because of a couple of unexpected storms during winter. More grass during the spring means more dry grass during the summer. But the actions that we need to take and that is, you know, establishing fuel breaks, reducing vegetation, hazardous fuels around your home, things like that. The Kauai Fire Prevention Bureau agrees. Some other tips it offers. Remove flammable materials from the areas outside or around your home. Keep your lawn hydrated and shorter than four inches. And do not mow your lawn during the hottest time of day or when it's windy. And have an escape route ready. So it sort of feels like they're happening more often, um, but I, it's more a function right now of just the coverage and the attention being paid to it, um, which is rightfully so, right? I and mean, people are, are, are right, right to be concerned with it. They, they can be quite dangerous. Stephen Florino, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.